This content has been deemed inappropriate for children under 13. Viewer discretion is advised. This is for adults only, adult collectibles. What's up, guys? It's Zach Jack Dan back with another Every Marvel Legends video. This time we're talking about every X Men or Deadpool wave of Marvel Legends. Also, X Force is in this video. So, the first Wolverine wave or X Men wave was for Puck. And we actually did not get the Rogue and the Cyclops from this wave. So it's technically a four-figure wave plus the Build-A-Figure. So you, in order to build Puck, you actually had to buy the Cyclops, the Emma, and the Sabretooth. The Wolverine only came with a figure stand. The next one was a really rare wave, too. It was a Jubilee Build-A-Figure, which was a Toys S exclusive. So in order to build Jubilee, you needed to buy the Strife, Magneto, Cyclops, Storm. Again, Wolverine came without any kind of Build-A-Figure pieces. Next one in the cat was the Juggernaut Build-A-Figure Wave. Juggernaut, you needed to buy Rogue, Cable, Jean, Kitty, Iceman, Havoc, and Wolverine in order to build him. This time you did not have to buy the Deadpool. And Deadpool came with amazing amount of weapons here. Next one was the Red Onslaught, and the reason I say this is because you had to buy the Kitty in order to get the Magneto head for this Red Onslaught. Next one we got is Warlock. Warlock, you had to buy Dazzler, Sunfire, Colossus, Cyclops, Shatterstar, and Polaris in order to build him. And you had Old Man Logan that was there by himself in a very, very, very empty package. Next is a, technically a Deadpool wave. It was a Sasquatch build a figure. You had to buy the X Force Deadpool, the Cable, Domino, X23, and the X Force costume, Deathlock, and Paladin in order to build him. And this time you had a, another very empty package for the Red Deadpool. Next is the Apocalypse build a figure wave. In order to build Apocalypse, you needed to buy the one of the versions of Psylocke, Storm. Gladiator, Sabretooth, Multiple Man, and Magneto. You also had to buy the Wolverine. So in this case, you actually had to buy every figure in order to build him. And there was a different version version of the Psylocke with the purple hair. Next is technically a Deadpool wave again. This was the Sauron build a figure. And in order to build Sauron, you had to buy the Pantsless Deadpool. You had to buy the X-Men Deadpool, you had to buy the Lady Deadpool with Deadpool, Bishop, Omega Red, and Wolverine X-23. Next uh, was the Professor X in the hover chair, and in order to build the Shadow King, you had to get that head from the, you had to get the body from the Kingpin uh, Spider-Man wave. Next is the Caliban Build-A-Figure wave. In order to build Caliban, you needed to buy Beast, Weapon X Wolverine, Forge, Skullbuster, Blink, and Jubilee. And this time, Gambit did not have any kind of build a figure piece. The next one we have is the Wendigo build a figure. And in order to build Wendigo, you needed to buy Nightcrawler, X Force Wolverine, Guardian from Alpha Flight, Mr. Sinister. Boom Boom and Cannonball. And Cannonball was a disappointment here because they did not give us alternate legs for this uh, this body. Also coming out 2020, just announced at Toy Fair who the build a figure is, is the Sugar Man from the Age of Apocalypse wave. We already knew who all the other figures were. We just did not know the build a figure at the time. Very excited about this one. If they're all unpackaged, you can see what you have to build him with. So we still don't know them all, but here are two more from the Strong Guy Build a Figure Wave. We have the Black Tom Cassidy and the Maverick just announced at 2020 Toy Fair. And of course, we already knew we're getting Sunspot, Warpath, and Deadpool in his blue and gold, along with that Strong Guy Build a Figure. So here are all of the waves that we know loose so far. And here they all are in package.
And here's a wish list or most wanted list for X Men waves in the future. Love to see Armor, Avalanche, Destiny, Toad. Love to see Legion, a white version of Magneto, a Savage Rogue, an Evil Deadpool, Nimrod, Mimic. Love to see the Young X Men team and Weapon H. Let me know what you guys think about that list. So here's some stuff that was kind of off on the side. It's not waves, but it had X-Men on it. So here's an X-Men box set back in the Toy Biz days. Here's an SDCC X-Force box set. Psylocke, Archangel, and Wolverine. Here's the Toys R Us box set for the all-new X-Men with their classic costumes on. And then here is the Amazon exclusive box set with Alpha Flight. We also have another Toys R Us 2 pack here with Cyclops and Dark Phoenix. We have a Amazon exclusive 3 pack with Magneto, Quicksilver, and Scarlet Witch. It's called Family Matters, I think is what they called it. You have a fan channel exclusive, Havoc and Polaris from X Factor. And then also another fan channel exclusive is uh, Love Triangle with Wolverine, Gene, and Cyclops. And then another fan channel two pack with Deadpool and Hitmonkey and also Headpool. And then this was considered a GameStop exclusive, which the Archangel uh, had the several heads and also the claw for the Apocalypse Villa figure. Had the Amazon exclusive uh, Days of Future Past with Wolverine or old, um, yeah, Days of Future Past Wolverine and then Sentinel, which is a re-release pretty much of the Marvel Universe Sentinel. And then we have the Riders Wolverine. Also, we've got the patch alternate head. And then also, we've already mentioned Professor X, but here's the Deadpool and Professor X. Dog pool, squirrel pool. Here's that hover chair. And then here's some more fan channel individually carded. You've got the Cowboy Logan. You have the Back in Black Deadpool. You have the Hascon exclusive X Force Deadpool. And then you have the Vintage Wave Storm, Dazzler, Ninja Wolverine, X Factor Cyclops, Silver Samurai, and Iceman. Also, another vintage release that we're getting fan channel is the Deadpool. This time he's got a red strap, red gun. So just announced at the German Comic-Con, Dortmund is the black-suited Storm on the vintage card back. Going up for pre-sale, pre-order right now. Walgreen exclusives that we've gotten released here are the Magic, the Mystique, Emma Frost, the Danny Moonstar with the alternate heads. Also announced at the German Comic Con is the Walgreens version of the Step for Cuckoos. So this will be another army builder. We got about three of it in order to build these guys. So just announced the 2020 Toy Fair. We are getting a deluxe figure for the Age of Apocalypse. Apocalypse himself. This looks amazing. So excited for this. We are also getting a Nimrod. Not sure how this is going to be released. It will not be a build a figure. Uh, so it could be coming maybe through HasLab. I don't know. Or maybe a Deluxe. I don't know. We'll see. Also from Old Man Logan here with the Hulk Baby. We have the Storm from the 90s. And also the Rogue here in her newer costume. Don't know what's going on with her hair there. Hopefully they'll fix the the head sculpt before they release this one. And all of these Fox X-Men that will be getting in 2020. The Cable, Walmart exclusive, the Wolverine, Amazon exclusive. 
the Magneto with the two different head sculpts, the Deadpool Negasonic Teenage Warhead 2-pack, Domino from Deadpool 2, Mystique and Wolverine with his jacket on from X-Men, and then the Professor X with both different head sculpts. That's crazy, guys. And just announced, we have another fan channel exclusive vintage card back. We have the Gray Beast. Comes with the glasses and a book and an alternate head. This thing looks amazing. Can't wait to get this one. Go pre order it now. And then we got the X Men Classic stuff. We're going to kind of fly through these right here. Series one. Series two. Series three. And then from the X-Men Origins Wolverine, you had a couple two packs. Guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest. You can find all the photos that you want of these videos.